Hello all, welcome back. So today I'm going to show you how to configure the network security groups um, via the CLI. So uh, which is similar to the security list, um, we are going to convert an Excel uh, Excel sheet of the data that we've captured in an Excel sheet uh, to um, JSON files. And those JSON files will be moved to the OCI CLI and uh, we can use a shell script there. And which is kind of little interactive. We can use that to create an MSG and add the uh, rules to that MSG. So here, let's say if I will have to just run the Python script. <clears throat> when I run it, it's giving me 118 and 5, which means uh, there are 118 rules in the Excel sheet, which has got split to five um, JSON files. So you'll be able to see all of them uh, like this. So it creates these five JSON files. Reason being uh, in one API call, not more than 25 rules to, uh, are allowed to, add it, to get added at this point in time. So we're just splitting this into different files and then we're going to add them via different uh, API calls. The next step is to move all these files, these five files, um, just drag and drop with the shell script um, to the OCI CLI. Just quick, uh, we'll go, if you just do a drag, drag and drop, then you'd be able to see uh, all these files here. And here um, we do a change mod permission to NSG shell, shell script. And then we just run the NSG shell script. So it gives me three options. One is create NSG, add rules and quit. So I'd say create first. It in immediately asks me to enter the compartment ID, which I would find uh, here this is my personal tenancy, so I don't mind sharing my OSIDs at this point in time. So if I go to my compartment, I enter the compartment ID, and then let me go to the VCN. I have test VCN. Let me capture recent ID, enter it here, I give a name, automate. That creates uh, a network security group called automate. Let's see here. This has the VCN ID. Uh, the OSIT for that uh, will be network security group will be this. So you'll see the same uh, also given here. 5SQ. And now we, we can either quit or we can go to the next option, which is adding the rules. So I'll say two. Then here, it's uh, it would ask me for the NSGO. So, um, so I'd enter the... Uh, the NSGO so, so option number two is to create add rules to the existing uh, NSG. So uh, as soon as I enter the NSG OSIT, it would start populating the rules. So all these five JSON files would start get added. There you go. You see those getting added here, and both ingress and egress rules are get have got added successfully. Now. It's just a matter of you attaching this NSG to uh, the required uh, Venix and uh, you're done. Thank you so much.